Hello everybody, it is John. It is an unboxing of a different sort. We're looking at one of the secondhand games, Ugh, old games. An unboxing of a different sort, yes. We're looking at a game called Barony. Yes, I've recently had this come into my collection from my good friends Matt and Wanda. So thank you very much for selling your collections. I, go, I love my friends when they decide that they want to... Uh, to part with some of their games that I've played and enjoyed. It's a marvellous way to expand my collection and for them to know that their games are going to a good place because my place is always a good place for the games to go to because they know that they can always come back here to play it. Yes. So anyway, let's go and have a look at what's in this box. Hello everybody, we are looking at yet another different version of an unboxing. This is a second hand game that I picked up from my good friends Matt and Wanda who were selling some of their games and uh, I really do enjoy picking up games that uh, I have played, that I've enjoyed and that people no longer want. And. Uh, running out of shelf space again so I'm gonna to have to go buy myself some more shelves because hey look I never cull it's hang on to as many games as you can and the person who dies with the most of them in the end wins well actually no you don't win when you die but look <laughs> it's just one of those things look this game uh, really did appeal to me I played uh, I played some games on the weekend and I've now added some more games to my uh, to my list. I played one called The Court of Miracles that I really did enjoy. I must thank my good friend Tony for bringing that one along. That uh, So much so that uh, Matt and Wanda decided they'd go and buy it. So, oh dear, we are weak-willed people. But anyway, Barony looked. I played that and uh, I really liked it. I could see it working well with the, uh, with the people that I know. Uh, it plays two to four people. Goes for 45 minutes, ages 14 and plus, oh, 14 and up. Uh, there is conflict in this game, so, uh, uh, but again, it's all about racing up a, uh, a score board. So we'll go and have a look at what's in the box. So this is the the box obviously everything's all unboxed but look this is the rules can you get any better than just that number of pages so it can't be that complex can it well I'm quite sure it'll probably defeat me so I'll still have to have somebody teach me it again but um, you have um, the tiles are <coughs> very simple so you've got tiles that are put down they dictate where you can um, move people to and what defense bonuses and that you will get from memory uh, I'm not going to try and remember everything because look I'm dreadful at trying to explain rules I'm not a rules person I'm only a person who can explain to you and say look I really enjoyed this game. It was wonderful. I think you should really go out and buy it because I enjoyed the experience of playing the game and I think that you would do yourself a great justice to uh, to buy the game or find somebody who's got it and play it because I think you will enjoy the game as much as I did. So, um, yes, I would think that... Uh, that is the best recommendation that I can probably do because I have the uh, capacity to remember games uh, as much as a goldfish remembers things. So, uh, well, what was it? Dory from Finding Nemo. Yes, that's about my capacity to remember things. So, but yeah, this these boards are for the players. They explain everything very, very simply and concisely. So they are the actions that you can uh, that you can do during play. So for the four players, that's what there. That is what is there. And with the um, so with the uh, 
the victory points. Ippy, come on, no more barking, please. Uh, see, I've lost my big black Alsatian. She's gone back home and Pippin's picked up all her bad habits of barking very loudly. So, but anyway, uh, the score points. So the scoring is very interesting in this because you can actually jump down levels and um, I can't quite remember how that happens but it's an interesting scoring system so uh, but nevertheless I won't try to explain it because I'm quite sure I'll get it wrong but again it's it is quite good the look honestly these playing pieces are very nice very nice indeed so there's obviously for every player there are the uh, these are the victory points that uh, that people will earn and they are for the different types of terrain that people will be um, will be fighting over or will, yeah fighting over I think is the best way to try and explain it but uh, yeah so that is what's in barony and uh, I was I must admit very very surprised when I saw that uh, Matt and Wanda were putting it up for sale so uh, needless to say I'm happy enough to have acquired it and uh, and once again if they ever want to play it they know where it's where it is sitting because uh, I always look after my games and uh, being the uh, archivist or archivist uh, I never throw anything away and never sell my games so everybody knows where they can come to get a game. So anyway, there we go. That is Barony. It's from Matigo. And uh, so thank you everybody for watching. If you've played Barony, I, as I said, I enjoyed the game. I've only played one game of it. If you've played it, look, leave your thoughts. And um, till next time, signing off, the Honourable John.